Hi all folks, this is Max from Zetomax.com and uh, HTCEvoHacks.com. So there's a, um, I got the, I un yesterday I unrooted my phone and then I uh, installed the latest OTA update and I was very disappointed because it wasn't that fast, I mean it was gingerbread but now only after a day there's a new ROM called TIX which is basically um, based off the stock ROM that was announced yesterday and let's go install it I'm having some trouble with the virus ROM the camera works but it's laggy and weird so go go, go copy over the TI-X GBSense the zip file I'll have links to it on my blog post and on this video and then let's boot back into the bootloader mode power off All right, and then and then what we'll do is after it's powered off, go into bootloader, volume down, power button, as always. Um, I've been jumping from ROMs to ROM like pff, for the last couple of days. I just want a stable ROM that's you know fast and good. Anyway, go to recovery, hit the power button, and uh, today I had to root my phone again to root back to. Um, root your phone after you do the latest OTA update all you gotta do is unroot it back to 2.2 uh, I have instructions on my site accvohacks.com and then just simply um, do the rooting method for 2.2 which is also there um, so now we're gonna do uh, wipe and wipe all data factory reset this is just so you get you know you just kind of wipe everything otherwise you know, you if it's the same ROM, you might not have to, and then you'll keep all your apps. But and then go to wipe down the cache power button, and then return and flash zip from SD card. Choose zip from SD card, and then go choose the um, TI-X GB Sense OTA that one, the one you copied over earlier. Hopefully, power button, power button again. It's gonna update. Um, actually, installation of boarded. Just toggle signature verification and try again. Choose zip from SD card and uh, TI X and power button. And uh, Evo 3D is coming out, and I'm gonna, I'm so excited. Um, and anyway, this is gonna take like five minutes. So if you have to go to the bathroom, I'm um, go now. And then uh, also, if you need to grab some coffee. Um, you can go now, and I'm gonna go have a smoke real quick, so I'll be back when this is done. Hi, all folks. So I hope you went to the bathroom, and uh, it's done. We turn, and then reboot system. Now we're gonna boot up, and uh, I'm gonna go go to the bathroom again. So see y'all later. Hi, all folks. So I've got the new um, what is the ROM called? TIX Evolution Gingerbread Sense based ROM. This is based on the latest OTA. I like it. Uh, everything works. Uh, camera works. Nothing laggy. Um, 4G works. Um, you'll get it's pretty much basically everything uh, stock but also the speeds are faster on an impact. Let me run that test for you. I was getting like almost 25 which is better. The stock one I was getting yesterday like 12 See, I'm getting 18, so it's much better improvement over the regular stock ROM. Um, so I highly recommend this, and also it comes with a uh, Google Chat working. 30, there you go. It's kind of up and down, don't know why, maybe it's still sinking. But I'm getting 30, so this is definitely the gingerbread ROM to get right now, and I know that's going to change like this whole week. So I'll have updates on uh, some more stuff comes with all this written stuff, um, it comes with Google Google stuff, so you got the uh, video if you want to do video, and I uh, can do a quadrant test real quick for you, unfold and benchmark, um, it's going to be interesting when uh, CM74 HCC EVO is available, I know the, the one that I used before was buggy, but Hopefully, the new one based on the kernel will be a lot better. Um, so, it's, 
It's all right, I guess. And uh, TIX Titanium X is supposed to be. Anyway, I'm gonna stick to this ROM for like a couple days, hopefully. And uh, you know the stock gingerbread. Oh, I don't recommend it. It's just slow and horrible. You know, but the ROMs based off it is gonna be just awesome. Obviously. And I'm getting thousand. Yeah. Um, later on, there should have be there should be a stable. Uh, well, I can overclock it, and uh, we'll see what that goes. But that was the review of the Titanium X. Basically, it's based off the stock ROM. Everything works. You get all the apps um, if you want to root, and also you can get free Wi-Fi tethering. You have to get the just go Google Android Wi-Fi tether and install it on your phone. Anyway, thanks for subscribing. We'll have more hacks. Um, See y'all later.